I am at the Ohio State Fair and we're going to go into the Natural Resources Park which is right by the 11th Avenue entrance is right over there so we're at the southeast corner of the fair that building there is the chickens and geese and ducks and rabbits so it's pretty easy to find I'm not gonna like, go in every display but here you got butterflies and you got birds We'll go inside the Avery area here. And this is free. It's part of your admission into the fair, so you don't have to pay anything extra. Now we'll check out the butterflies. I've seen any butterflies, I see them up here flying around. Not the Viceroy. I think the Viceroy has the black mark across the wing. I mean, this is a monarch. Another one right here. Here it basically tells you about some of our native birds and actually some salamanders where they're at, mammals of Ohio. Really wet nut hatches. Here and we'll look at some of the live birds over here. They got birds of prey like an eagle, 
I think they got a red tail hawk. And here they got a bald eagle. These animals have all been injured some way or another. That's why they're here, because they no longer would survive in captivity, being maybe they were hit by a car, some type of injuries to their wings or whatever. We got a great horned owl. I don't know how we're gonna see him. I don't even see him in there. They may have him out. Barred owl. There he is, up there on the right side. Skunk. There were two of them in here the other day. I don't see any of them today, but there were two here the other day. They take these out throughout the day too and take them out into the yard so people can actually really get personal experience with them. Red Fox, which I don't see, and he's just a little guy. He's, oh, there he is underneath this one log right here. You see his leg? See him right there? Trying to stay cool. Here's the red tailed hawk. This one was injured. He's got, I think it's his right wing. When they've had him out, you can tell he doesn't hold it right. Turkey vulture. Now this store here, Wild Ohio store, you can actually renew or purchase your fishing or hunting license. Right here. Here's for the kids can go fishing. I believe they're catching bluegill. Uh, 14 years and under. Over here, we've got more information on fishing, hunting. Over here on the side, get yourself a sample, some walleye or perch. <laughs> yep, and you're about guaranteed. Right? Yeah. This is walleye here. They put season on. They're really good. So make sure you stop here and get yourself a sample before you take off. Again, this is where the kids are fishing. Yeah, the fishing licenses sold there too. Here's your archery range. Try your hand at archery. I'm not gonna go in, but. You can try your hand at that too. There's all kinds of activities back there. Air gun range. Try your hand at air guns. Then we got a little pollinator garden. <clears throat> I don't 
don't see any pollinator activity right now. Bees or anything going on. That right there is 11th Avenue. So that goes to show you where the natural resource park is at within the fairgrounds. Here's another booth over here with some more information on on uh, hunting and a little bit of everything right here, I believe. A little play area for the kids. Another thing I like about the natural resource area, if you notice, it's shaded compared to the main fairgrounds, which you're always in the sun. Um, ODNR, Division of Oil and Gas. I'm just skimming past the stuff so you can get an idea of what's here. A lot of these are repetitive year after year. You might get some new group in here, but most of them are pretty much the same. Here you got the amphitheater. Lumberjack shows, a little bit of everything here. Musicals. Looks like maybe a band getting ready to play down there now, but they do a lot of um, balancing on, on logs in the water or rolling them. Um, chainsaw guy cutting little stools out of the log, chainsaw, all kinds of really great stuff here. They got a schedule right out front here. Tells you everything that's going on. And the times. Plus you can also find it on their website and brochure. Of interesting stuff in this building right here. We're gonna go down here to the end. We're going from the end out to the other side. This is the Discovery Pavilion. I was trying to see if I could find the schedule for the amphitheater. Okay, they do it day by day. So this is the schedule for today. So 11 o'clock, Home Sound Bath, Great Lakes Timber Show, Canines for Conservation. You can get into it here too. Uh, that over there is where we come in, where the aviary and butterfly is at. And if you come this way, you'll cross this little bridge. You come over here to Smokey the Bear. And this is live. Okay, you actually ask your name and everything. This isn't automated. This is actually live. Come on. Hi. My good friend. Come on now. Let's pose for the picture. Eric, you gotta get in here. I don't know where the guy's at. Come on. It's doing the vocals for this, but this is actually live. He'll speak to you directly. Say you by your name, ask your name. Okay, here's a discovery building. In here you got a little bit of everything. Geology, forestry. This is where you come and find ODNR's live stream. If you want to check out the live stream. You got Helgramites and crayfish and uh, oh, all kinds of things. Kids love that because they like catching all kinds of stuff, and you can catch this stuff in there. Um, 
We got ODNR here. I mean, ODNR over here. And each ODNR booth has something different. And Plinko or Spin the Wheel, make sure you play them everywhere because you can win some stuff, man. They got them all over. Almost every booth has something you can get for free or, or spin. Here we got some of the native fish in Ohio. Come out the other side here. Here you can sign up if you want to do some uh, kayaking. Sign up right here. And you can do some kayaking over here. <clears throat> here we got. Natural resource officer, uh, watercraft, learn about watercraft and stuff. And they're always looking for people to work. Well, it looks like people standing there, it's probably ain't much more than a couple feet deep. So, if you don't know how to swim, it's not a big issue because it's not deep. It <laughs> just stand up but I have never seen anybody yet fall out or tip their kayak it's pretty self-controlled you know just go at your own pace do what feels comfortable for you like I said here we got law enforcement Ohio watercraft Yeah, and just look at the shade back here. It's so cool back here. Compared to when you're out there in the fair, it's nothing but hot heat. <laughs> here we got the Buckeye Trail Association. This is where I volunteer at this year. Learn about the Buckeye Trail. Hike the Buckeye Trail, which goes around the state of Ohio. A little over 1,400 miles. <laughs> Well, that's one of the volunteers manning the station now. <laughs> yeah, it's uh goes around the state of Ohio a little about 1446 miles. Through hike it or just section hike? Yes. Have you checked out a yurt? Yeah, I've been in there. Okay. Here we got our van. Ohio Lodges, <laughs> more parks and watercraft, another Plinko game, and throw the rings on there and win something on there, I don't know what you want. Let's go that way yet. Kids can do some coloring and drawing. I'm not going to go inside, but this is ODNR's gift shop. You can find all kinds of things. And even on the outside, they got a bunch of free stuff. Then on the inside, you can buy stuff. So you got some free stuff there. And you go inside, and you find a lot more stuff. T-shirts and postcards and oh, just about everything. And the money helps support ODNR. Here you got uh, Ohio Geological Service. Learn about the geology of Ohio from the pros. And another spin the wheel. This here shows you a little bit about the geology of Ohio. Look for your county. We got a map over here. And there's Smokey the Bear again. So we won't go that way. Vision of forestry vehicle.
We also got an entrance right there. There's three entrances exits to this. One we come in by the ch chickens and all that stuff. And that one here by the gift shop. And then the one down here at the end, which we're gonna walk to here in a minute. There are restrooms in here. There's places you can get water in here, drink a fountain. Okay, here's the Ohio Parks and Wildcrafts again. Little nature center. There's live animals in there. A little bit of live animals. Restroom. They're doing scavenger hunt in here. Find the things and win a prize. A little sitting area with water. And this is the other entrance and exit. Right out towards the midway and the rides and so forth. So this is a natural resource park. Again, it's free. It's part of your admission into the fair. And if you want to get out of the sun and check out our natural resources, come check out this area here.